I'm Sarah Eisenberg, founder and publisher of Santa Cruz Tech Beat. Santa Cruz Tech Beat is the go-to source for all things tech in our region, from comprehensive news about local tech business developments and startups, to thought leadership from our local tech ecosystem, to breakthroughs in genomics and engineering at UC Santa Cruz. Plus, TechBeat has job and event listings and more. I'm here to tell you about some current developments in the local tech scene that you need to know. Let's start with some apps that have made the news in Santa Cruz recently. The numerous app recently featured in the Best New App section in Apple's App Store allows you to put your life's important numbers in one place so you don't have to dig through other apps for information. For example, you can easily track exchange rates or the current rate for a 30-year mortgage, track your startup's cash and burn numbers, or track numbers on your wearable fitness device. Numerous can track more life-critical numbers as well. A parent could use the Apple Health app in conjunction with Numerous to track a child's blood glucose level. If that number were to reach a, certain, a chosen threshold, Numerous would trigger a message to notify the parent. One new app on the scene is Foodworthy, an image-based food rating app. Produced by UC Santa Cruz student Josh Bernfeld, Foodworthy encourages users to snap and share photos of their food at restaurants and provide a short review. Users have access to up-to-date results of the most popular food in their area. One new app will take the tra traditional baseball card and give it a high-tech facelift. U-Sport is in beta right now. Founder Ryan Lowe said that U-Sport exists to give an athlete at any level a way to share their memorable sports moments, including video and stats, with coaches, fans, and other players in a fun and fast way. Looking beyond apps, most of us in the local tech community would agree that Looker, a business intelligence startup, is one of Santa Cruz's shining stars. Last March, Looker closed a $30 million round of financing. More recently, Forbes magazine published their list of top 100 analytics startups in 2015, and Looker made the list. In UC Santa Cruz news, researchers in the Baskin School of Engineering are working with industry partner Seagate Technologies on a new way to structure and store massive amounts of genomic data. Seagate's gift, valued at $250,000, will support the study of large-scale data storage challenges in genomics. Speaking of genomics, UC Santa Cruz's Genomics Institute has hired a new managing director, Ravi Jain. Dr. Jain comes to UC Santa Cruz after serving as president and CEO of CBio, a software development and bioinformatics consulting firm that he co-founded. He will work alongside scientific director David Hausler and oversee the Institute's strategic planning, development, and operation. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time for more news and developments from the Santa Cruz tech scene. And of course, for the latest news, jobs, and events anytime, go to santacruztechbeat.com.